Hey everybody, what's up? It is Daddy Vapor. Hey, today I'm going to be bringing you a e-liquid out of the box that I was sent by a friend of mine. And uh, I had not heard of this company before, and I went and checked them out. And it is called the Great Lakes Juice Company. And you can get there by going to greatlakesjuiceco.com. Uh, the flavor that I'm doing for you today is called Sleeping Bear. And it is a frosted long john donut with a creamy vanilla center. Um, this juice was surprisingly good. Uh, I had not heard of it before. That's the only reason why I'm saying it was surprisingly good. There's a lot of juice companies out there that are awesome that we've never heard of before. And this one would go into the category of that. I don't know if I have any other flavors from them in the box that I was sent, but I will review this one for you right now. Now, this is a 30 mil bottle for $9.99. You can go all the way up and get the 120 mil bottle for $32.99. Now, one thing I can say about this e-liquid is um, they do have the Long John Donut flavor. Uh, they could increase the flavor a little bit more. And I would be much happier with it. Um, <clears throat> on a scale of 1 to 10, the flavor is probably around a 7. But as far as being an all-day vape, this would be an 8 or a 9. Because it is very good. And if they increase their flavor a little more, it would probably get a better flavor rating from me. Now, this is one that you do need to engage your nose in. If you're just vaping through your mouth and exhaling out your mouth, you're not going to get as much enjoyment out of it as you normally would. But if you're somebody who likes a pastry-style vape, this is actually a very good one to try. It's not over the top. Some vape companies try to make them, and they make them way over the top of what they should be. Uh, this one is definitely not too sweet. It tastes like a Long John Donut. And if you are familiar with them, they're not a super sweet donut. They're very good, but they're not overly sweet. Now, I just get little hints of the creaminess in this. And like I said, you really pick the flavors up on the exhale. When I exhale it, it smells like you've walked into a donut shop that is cooking these type of donuts. It's not the overwhelming smell. It's not the overwhelming flavor that you sometimes get from some of the pastry donuts. So as far as that goes, I'm really, really enjoying it. I wish they would increase the flavor a little bit more. Uh, not by a ton. It doesn't need a ton of improvement on it. But it's a very good vape. Like I said, on a scale of 1 to 10, for me, the flavor is probably going to be around a 7 because I think it needs to be increased. But as far as an all-day vape, yeah, it actually could be an all-day vape because there's nothing offensive about it at all. It's not overly sweet. It has a nice flavor. And it's something that I could probably see myself vaping all day. So <clears throat> that's kind of what I have to say about them. Like I said, I don't know much about the company. When I checked out the company's website, I saw that they had around five products, which is fine. If you're making those five products as good as this one is, like I said, small improvement is all it needs. Uh, that's all you need to do to make a good product. But uh, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can also follow me on Instagram and on Facebook, Daddy Vapor. And you can now find me on Twitter at ZDaddyVapor.com. I'd always said I'd never get a Twitter. That's why I have a hard time saying that. Everybody have a great day and vape on.